Hello guys, it's Farmer Beavis once again with another little mod roundup. And yeah, today we're gonna take a look at uh, various Case Puma tractors. Okay, let's start over here. Here we have the first um, three packs of tractors. Um, these are from Paradox Agi on Mod Hoster. Basically, what you have, you have the normal um, wheeled version of the Case Puma 160. You have the Case Puma 160 with road tracks. And you have the quad track version. And within these three packs, um, wheeled, road track, quad, quad track, you have three configuration of the tractor, or three configurations of the tractor. Um, the normal one, as you see here, this is basically the in-game case Puma, but only put on different wheels and with color choice. Then you have um, a front loader version, which can take the normal front loader from in-game. And the forest version, which has um, a cage and you, uh, you can use the normal front loader, but um, it's recommended to use a special front loader that I will link in the comments that is also or in the description that is also from Paradox Agi. And all these things are color, color customizable. Um, here it shows a kind of black version. This is the normal case IH red, and this is for the forest. I just thought green would look awesome yeah this is the case one six or case puma 160 um yeah let's move over here to the case puma 230 this is also from paradox agi so basically the same deal you have the 230 but um in four configurations this time the normal um version with wheels duels these are permanent duels not um switchable um, you have the road tracks again and quad tracks and this one also comes in three different variants you see the normal variant you see a front loader variant here um, this one also comes with um, or in all the configurations I just was running out of room on the yard here to um, present them so as I said the front loader version is available as a dual version as road track and as quad track version and of course you have once again the um, forest version with also which also comes in all the different variants and of course um, also color customizable um, feature wise these are pretty standard we can get into this one here as you see we have no IC it's basically the the in-game model just um, on this one it's the 230 so it's a bit um, beefier and it has the front loader console um, nothing too fancy here so um, these are very standard tractors but um, I really like to use them so um, if you if you watch my um, Baldacchino series you recognize this one here very well um, this is a the 160 front loader is something on the that I have on that series from the beginning. So um, very good tractors, very nice to use, especially for front loader duties. But yeah, um, if you are into something a bit, or if you want a bit more details, then um, these ones over here may probably more tickle your fancy. Um, first of all, these front loaders over here are from the Hydrak front loader pack. I will put a link to that in the description as well. You can use any other front loader with those things as well. So yeah, let's um, take a look at this one here first. This is a case Puma 160, and as you see, as of uh, as of right now, the um, f uh, the front um, fenders are missing. But if we walk up to it, you see we have an option to mount these uh, thingies here. Um, yeah, you can either um, mount them or remove them. Uh, we can also open and close the door from the outside. If we go on the inside, we have a movable steering column. And of course, we have a, we have a window on the roof. We can 
open the back the back window and of course we can open and close the door from the inside so let's get going here um one thing that this thing has as well if you notice the front linkage is now folded and if we select um, this thing here on the on the joystick you see that the front um, linkage comes down and if we just go over here and set down our front loader for a minute yeah preferably without crashing into the building beavis um, and then pull out we can when we are on the outside we can remove the um, front loader console and have this as a normal tractor so yeah this is for the 160 um, this um, then we have the uh, 230 over here the base features are the same so you can um, remove uh, add or um, remove or add the um, fenders in the front you have the normal in cap um, things only difference here is um, the front linkage folds automatically and um, yeah one more thing um, this thing sounds a bit beefier it's of course the, the 230 so as you hear um, this is a bit of a modified um, 230 uh, something done to the exhaust and all that um, bit more beefier yeah and as, as I said the front linkage folds automatically otherwise um, this thing is absolutely comparable to the 160 over there it's done by the same model um, the 160 the 230 and the 230 black edition over there are all done by timber 131 who is an excellent model yeah and um, I just will move the 230 here out of the way and then we're gonna look at the last 230 over there the 230 platinum that um, some of you guys may recognize from my um, uh, lime spreader video this one is a edit of the 230 over there um, I think it has a slightly different sound it doesn't have the front loader console but um, what it has is when we go back here you can add um, wheel weights these are purely cosmetical from what I have seen otherwise the feature set is the same um, the front linkage doesn't auto fold so if you want to have it out of the way you have to use the um, thing on the joystick otherwise um, also a nice machine if you if you look over here we have some um, we have some uh, control units from various implements I think the back one here is for a uh, um, menu spreader this one is for a uh, um, swaffer or loading wagon and the harsh one is for a cedar so yeah um pretty nice and detailed um of course we have instrument lighting on all of those yeah um only thing i have to add is um with these ones here where the um, linkage auto folds of course if you want it to fold down manually you can still select it on the ic yeah um other than that these are wonderful tractors i mean um you have seen one or two of them on on my other series so yeah i love to use them i really grew fond of the case puma um also thanks to toby moby but anyhow um yeah that shall be it for now um links will be in the description down below and please understand that i can't take any all of the tractors for a spin um it's basically they behave very similar to the case in game so there's nothing wrong with them um these ones here are a bit more fancy um if you want details like opening doors and the wheel weights and stuff like that but um they are all um, perfectly usable, no bugs, um, 
I get a bit of a performance lag, but that is because I have so many tractors standing around here. Um, yeah, as I said, links will be in the description down below. And um, if you enjoyed yourself, um, consider leaving a like. That would be awesome. And as always, I thank you guys very much for taking the time and watching this. And I shall see you later. Thank you.